The Saginaw residents will see a reduction in services come July if city leaders approve a trimmed down budget for the upcoming fiscal year. NBC 25's Jane Park live in Saginaw where the mayor and city council getting their first look at the draft budget. Jane? Bill, City Manager Darnell Early is calling this a responsible budget that allocates very scarce resources in the best way possible. Of course, we've known for months that police and fire services would take a big cut. In short, the general fund for 20, uh, 2014 is almost a million dollars less than last year's general fund budget and it elim elim eliminates a $3.2 million deficit. The police and fire departments bear the brunt of the cuts. 36 po sworn police officer positions and 15 firefighter positions will be cut, leaving the city with 55 police officers and 35 firefighters. Saginaw City leaders were unsuccessful earlier this year in trying to avoid these cuts by contracting police services to the county sheriff. I don't think anyone would argue that we give too many services to the taxpayers of the city of Saginaw. What everyone will order, I mean, will argue is that uh, the ability to do that is becoming more and more uh, difficult, but they want those services, and we have an obligation to provide those services at the level that we can afford. The city council needs to approve a budget by the end of this month, 30 days before the start of the fiscal year on July 1st. Adoption is scheduled for May 20th after a public hearing. We'll have much more on the city manager's budget draft on NBC 25 News at 11. But for now, live in Saginaw, Jane Park, NBC 25 News.